Hi, my name is Hardy Rupan and I am the man in the wild. Recently, my brother and I did a camping and fishing adventure. We did not plan to record this adventure, although we did catch a lot of fish. But there was one fish in particular I wanted to share with you. So I took out my camera and made a little video so I could share it. Do enjoy. In Trinidad, this fish is called an ancho. Ancho is considered to be a fisherman's fish. Which means when a fisherman catches this fish, he will not sell it. He will keep it for himself because of its delicious flavor and texture. Mm -hmm. oh. My brother and I is having an overnight fishing camping adventure. And minutes ago, we just caught this ancho. As fresh as can be, we are cleaning this fish to make a fish roast. Ancho is one of the more firm textured fishes. It's very delicious. And because it is firm, it's ideal for roast, grill, and fry. But we also do make broth, curries, and stews. It is a delicious fish to be cooked any way you please. One of my favorite ways to cook is roast, and another is an ancho burritos. Tonight, we are going to make an ancho roast and enjoy it in this beautiful ambience of an overnight camp. Because an ancho is a fisherman's fish, most people do not know of this fish as it is not commonly seen in the fish market. The fishermen usually keeps it for themselves. But those who know this fish knows it's one of the most delicious fish you can enjoy. To season, we simply add some fresh sea salt and some bandania cambran lime sauce. The final piece has been seasoned. We just have to wrap it up and put it on the fire. All the pieces has been placed on the fire. Within 10 minutes, we will be enjoying some delicious roast ancho. It is so peaceful, relaxing, and enjoyable to sit at the campfire in the wilderness, waiting to enjoy a meal that you caught and prepared for yourself. This is living. Don't forget to like and share this video with your friends. Subscribe if you haven't already. I will catch you guys on the next adventure. Like and subscribe to get more info from Hardy Rupan, the man in the wild.